Hello and welcome to Point of View. Finally the news we have all been waiting for with bated breath. India has unveiled for Air Force pilots, who have been shortlisted to travel on the country's maiden space flight scheduled for next year. Prime Minister Modi announced the names of the four astronauts, who will be part of Kagunyan. To be launched in 2020 for 25 PM Modi, who is on a visit to Kerala, reviewed the progress of Gaganyan mission at the Vikram Sarabhai Space Center. The Gaganyan mission aims to send three astronauts to an orbit of 400 kilometers and bring them back after three days. India's space agency ISRO has been carrying out a number of tests to prepare for the flight. In October, a key test demonstrated that the crew could safely escape the rocket in case it malfunctioned. After its success, ISRO said a test flight would take a robot into space in 2024, before astronauts are sent into space in 2025. At a function at the ISRO Center in the southern city of Trivandrum on Tuesday, the four astronaut designates were described as dreamers, adventurers and valiant men preparing to go into space. The officers, chosen from the Indian Air Force, were introduced as Group Captain Prashanth Balakrishnan Nair, Group Captain Ajit Krishnan, Group Captain Angod Pratap and Wing Commander Shabhanshu Shukla, Prime Minister Narendra Modi and ISRO Chief S. Samonath pinned badges with golden wings onto their shirts and Mr. Modi described them as India's pride. These are not just for names or for people. They are for powers who will carry the aspiration of 1.4 billion Indians to space. I congratulate and wish them all the best, PM Modi said. The astronauts were selected from a pool of Air Force pilots and had undergone extensive physical and psychological tests before being shortlisted. They have undergone rigorous training for 13 months in Russia and are now carrying on with their grueling schedule back home. A video screened at the event showed them working out in the gym, swimming and doing yoga. On February 27, ISRO also showed a glimpse of Viamitra, Sanskrit word for space friend, the female humanoid, that will be sent into space later this year. The Gaganyan mission is India's first human spaceflight program, for which extensive preparations are underway at various ISRO facilities. Named after the Sanskrit word for craft or vehicle to the sky, the Gaganyan project has been developed at the cost of 90 billion rupees, or approximately $1 billion when it succeeds. India will become only the fourth country to send a human into space after the Soviet Union, the US and China. Gaganyan has generated a lot of interest in India and the global community of space enthusiasts, even though it's coming decades after Soviet Union and the US started making trips to the low. Earth orbit, both have been in space since 1961. China became the third country to reach space in October 2003, when a Chinese mission spent 21 hours and orbited Earth 14 times. The US and China now have fully operational space stations in low Earth orbit. People of a certain generation would recall that an Indian astronaut also went to space as early as in 1984 when Rakesh Sharma spent nearly eight days on a Russian spacecraft last year. India made major forays into space. The country made history by becoming the first to land Chandrayaan-3 near the moon's South Pole in August 2023. Just weeks later, scientists launched Aditya L-1, India's first observation mission to the sun, which is now in orbit keeping an eye on our solar system's most important and volatile star. India has also announced ambitious new plans for space, saying it would aim to set up a space station by 2035 and send an astronaut to the moon by 2040. That's a wrap. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.